First, open your preferred browser and type www.thelearningsciences.com slash platform slash login. This will take you to the main login page in which you need to provide your username and password. The login information was sent to your registered email address. In the top right corner of this page, you can also change the language in which you access the platform. Once you have typed in your login information, click on the Login button. You will arrive at the main platform page. On this page, you will see all the courses you are currently taking or have taken in the past. Here, you see two different courses. To access a course, you can click on the course name on the main screen. Alternatively, you can move your mouse to the top menu and hover over the My Courses option. There, you will see all of your courses and can click on the one you want to access. You are now on the course homepage. In the top right corner of the page, you can access your profile. Here, you can change your preferences as well as view and edit your profile. We suggest you do this in one of your first visits to the platform and include in your profile a short description of yourself and a picture. Right next to your name and picture, you will see three icons. The envelope icon takes you to the platform's email system. We ask that you use this option for all communications with the teaching team. Then you will see a bell, which is the notifications area that shows all new notifications for activity in the course room. For example, when new grades have been posted. Finally, you see two chat bubbles. While this feature lets you communicate with other participants, we prefer all communications remain in the regular mailing system. In the course homepage, you will find a link to a short invitation video to the class and a link to this classroom tour video. In the course description section, you will find a link to a full syllabus and a short description of the class. If you continue scrolling to the bottom of the screen, you will see an outline that contains a link to each module for the course. Finally, you will see a link to the instructors page where you can find a description of your course instructors. Here, you will also find a link to the course resources page. There are three ways in which you can access each course module. First, you can click on the links to each module on the course homepage. For example, you can access Module 0 by clicking on the Module 0 link. The second option you can use is to access the next module by clicking on the link that appears at the bottom of each page. However, this option only allows you to access the next module and does not let you skip to a particular module. Finally, on the left side of all course pages, you will find a link to each module. To show you how each module works, we will now explore Module 0. Each module follows the same logic. First, you will see key ideas and concepts for the module. Since courses and connections are flipped, you are expected to prepare for our live class encounter by completing a few pre-class activities. In Step 1, you will see the activities that you should complete before coming to class. Usually, that means completing a quiz, watching one or more videos, reviewing resources in bundles, and responding to a discussion board. Connections courses require attendance to synchronous classes using video conferencing tools. In Step 2, you will find a link to the Zoom classroom which you will need to access to attend the live class. You will also find the link to the 3 2, 1 reflection, an exercise that your instructor will have you work on during the last few minutes of class. Finally, you are also expected to complete work after class. In Step 3, you will find a link to the module's discussion board, where you should respond to at least two peers, and a link to the module's quiz, which you can take as many times as you like. We recommend accessing each module page as a way to keep track of the work that you need to do before, during, and after class. However, if you prefer, you can also access all activities by using the left menu. Here, you can find a shortcut to the course homepage, which we explored earlier, the Bundles and Resources page, where you can find all resources organized by module as well as additional resources. The Videos, Slides and Chat page, where you can find all pre-class videos and slides, as well as the live class recordings, chat transcript and slides. The 3 to 1 Reflections, the Discussion Boards, the Quizzes, the Zoom Classrooms, the Gradebook with all your grades and feedback, a list of class participants, a page with frequently asked questions where you can also post up any logistic and content questions you might have, the platform email system, and your ePortfolio. 
If you continue scrolling down, you can also find the course calendar, which gives you exact live class dates and due dates for all course assignments. This has been a tour of the Connections Online course room. If you need any additional help, feel free to reach out to us.